bleachers. Okay. And just like that. If that's the goal, this may be the result. Jacob Ferentz on top of the clubhouse. And Virginia on the board. Ferentz with his 11th home run of the season. It serves as the equalizer in inning number two. So just like that, when I'm driving my energy toward the right center gap, then you throw a fastball. Bit of a return to form for him, one of the main closers a couple of years ago. First pitch he delivers. Henry Ford connects on it and puts Virginia out front for the first time this weekend. Fourteenth blast of the season for the Virginia first year. They've been waiting to celebrate here at the dish. Virginia's most productive coming into the weekend. They used it again here. And that will roll up and into center field. It's going to mean a couple of runs come home, and Virginia's lead grows further. The casual fans at home saying, wait a minute, I didn't think they could do that anymore. Big league level, no. College baseball, absolutely still on the table. Here's another run that was on the table. O'Farrell sends this deep enough into right that Godbout trots home with Virginia's seventh run. And the Who's lead now five here in the sixth inning. Four runs, seventh. Up again in the eighth. O'Farrell to second for one. There's the turn. And a 6-4-3 double play as timely as they come for Virginia. Hungate works him into the dugout. Top of the order coming up for Virginia. Tech facing 9-1-2. Hanson. Right field. That's going to one-hop the fence. And Luke Hanson has a leadoff double in the bottom of the 11th to set the stage. Nearly everyone's feet on the grass. And Whalen bounces it right up the middle. Virginia evens the series with a Bobby Whalen walk-off in the 11th.